reached the top. Okay, we are at the very top now. Okay, hopefully there's no one in here. There's a console here. That's it. Connect the Omnistat drive and the virus will do the rest. And you should probably All right. some guards to show up any minute. Of, of course. Let's go ahead and do it. As I suspected, what do you hope to accomplish here? I'm giving people the right to decide things for themselves. Oh, Faith, hasn't it ever occurred to you that people might want reflection? They just want the pretty lie you're giving them, not the ugly truth. Oh, yes, the truth is always ugly, isn't it? As you should know. It's your mother's work that you intend to wreck, after all. She never wanted this. You perverted everything she ever stood for. What do you know of her reasons? You were a child. You're still a child, wantingly destroying everything around you. I promised your sister that I would capture you alive. Submit, and you won't be harmed. Never. And of course, he's going to leave us in the room. The feast to annoy him. Wait, why is it? I forget. It's one of... Ow. How do I, I don't know how you even block. I don't know how you even block in this game. Is there, is there a way to block? <laughs> I've never done it. <laughs> I've never paid attention to the combat marks, but <laughs> these guys are just obnoxious. These guys are annoying. I don't like, I don't like these guys. I'm just gonna run away. Are you guys disrupted? Get out of my way! They're just jumping on me! Can you s Of course, of only this game, only this game would understand how much the combat sucks. And how annoying and obnoxious it is more than anything. And throw it in at the last part of the game. With the worst enemies of the whole entire game. Why? Like, why are they doing- I don't understand why they're doing so much to me. Why are they doing so much damage? I don't have enough health. This is... I, li I can't do anything. I want you guys to know. I literally cannot do anything. Like, I can't. There's not a whole lot that I can do here. There's n Like, I don't have enough health. I don't have enough. I don't understand why. I don't have enough health for this. And I feel like because I can't upgrade my health anymore, that I'm just going to be screwed. Like, I don't have- they do so much health! Why? They're just jumping up on me! They're just jumping up on me! I can't do anything! Are you seeing this? Like, what am I supposed to do? Yeah, this is definitely the hardest part of the game. This is definitely the hardest part of the game. 
Yeah, I will say right now. This is definitely the hardest part of the game for me. How, what even hit me there? This is stupid. This is so, so stupid. Oh my gosh, this is definitely, and these are the hardest guys. I can take on one of them. Like if there's one of them, fine. Okay, I can do it, but there's two. And they're just like, It's like they kill me in like two hits. What is that? And they're like jumping up. I'm trying to like jump up on them. Why are they like uh, totally just ignoring that? And look at this, like one hit and I'm just down. See, like, look at that. Like, where did, I have to know where these guys. Come from. It just needs to be fast. Get up, Faith. You have to. I. You have to get up at right. Right now, you have to get up. How is he able to? How are they able? I don't understand that. I don't understand. Run, just run, Faith. You do this for a living. You literally do this for a living. That's what I don't understand, Faith. I don't know too many combos. So what you see is kind of what you're getting right now. Like, this is pretty much it. How are they? I don't understand. Okay. Just turn around and run. Oh god. Okay, they're almost, they're very low. I should have done that. Okay. Dang it. can't get out of this now I can't get out of this once they got me where am I like once they get me like once they punch me there's literally like nothing I can do 
That dude's just standing there. Okay, I got one. I got one. No, 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 no. Yes! Oh my goodness. I should have had you killed with your leech parents. You've lost Kruger. Your control ends here. Reflection is not about control. It's about survival. For you and the other families, maybe. It's time you all withered and died. By destroying Reflection, you're dooming your dear sister as well. I'm setting her free. Hardly. Isabel has a chronic lung condition. With reflection, we've managed to keep it at bay. Destroy You're it. You're lying. Am I? Am I lying? You almost managed to kill her once. Why not just go finish the Stay job? Stay back! Everyone around you dies, Faith. Did it ever occur to you that maybe you're the one to blame? You killed my family! You killed my friends! And you killed Noah. What the hell are you waiting for? Stop that thing and kill her! Follow cat. Wow. I'm just glad. Am I going the right way? I'm just glad that that fight is over. That was annoying. Of course I die. Of course I die right as we're ending up the game. Of course I die. Where do I go? Where am I supposed to go? How's Cat doing all of this? How's is she a runner? Is she even a runner? She's been working for Kruger. She's not even a runner. All right, Cap. I really don't understand where she went though. So I land right here. Oh, then I land right here. Okay, where is she though? I'm really confused as to where Cat went. <laughs> That's the problem. I'm really confused as to where she went. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Like, I don't know. Because I'm just sliding down. Okay. Let me take a look at this thing. I'm assuming... So I slide on this thing. But then where am I supposed to go? Okay, so. Apparently, I'm doing this right. But apparently there's a pad that we have to specifically fall on. I had to look this up because I had no idea where I was supposed to go. But. Apparently, we have to land on this. I had no idea I couldn't see that, so I had to look that up. Cat! Stop it! I hate you! Stop it, cat! My name! Is Isabel! 
my sister. I have no sister. You left me! Kat! I... He said you died in the riots. With mom and dad. I cried for months. And then I convinced myself that you never existed. It was the only way. He killed our parents. I saw it. And he's killed hundreds more for the sake of reflection. Isabel, come. We're leaving. You don't have to do what he says, Kat. You are your own person. This has gone on long enough. No, no, no! And that's how it all went down. I wish I could say everything changed. That the employees rose up in disgust over reflection and overthrew the conglomerate. But there was no mass uprising. No riots on the streets. Krugersek remained in control. Life went on as before. Or almost. Because something had changed. We'd started something. Something we intend to finish. All right. So... That was Mirror's Edge Catalyst. <laughs> um, that was it. Um, in all honesty, uh, while these are rolling, um, I, I kind of want to get my thoughts, uh, I guess a little, not necessarily a review, but just my thoughts and opinions on the game. Uh, I thought this was better than the first one. For a handful of reasons. Um, it felt a lot more fluid and fleshed out in terms of gameplay compared to the first one. The controls felt easier. I don't know if it's because I was using a different controller. I don't know if it was I was playing on a different system. I, I'm not sure, but it just felt a lot more fluid and easier to control at some points. At some points, I, at others, Faith was a little, um, especially with some wall jumps there towards the end. I don't know. Maybe it was just me, but it was just a little odd. Um, the combat still sucks. <laughs> the combat, I, I didn't like it in the first game. I don't like in this one. Um, I do have to say the the lack of gunplay was fun. Uh, we did not use a gun throughout this game, which I liked. Um, unfortunately, through the f my playthrough of the first Mirror's Edge, I did use a gun. I ended up stealing guns because it was just easier to get rid of the K-Sec fools. You know, it was easier to get rid of the goons because um, they're annoying. They're just obnoxious. And uh, but I did I did like the lack of gunplay on our end. Um, that was nice. We got to focus more on actual, you know, fists and, and fighting and whatnot. Still, it was annoying. I didn't care for it, but um, that's that. Um, I don't know. Is there anything? I don't know if there's anything after this, but um, the graphics looked amazing. I liked the art style of the game, and graphically, it looked really good. It did look really good. Um, 
like the the facial expressions looked realistic uh, everybody looked like actual humans it looked it, it was really nice really good graphics um, the art style I liked um, I liked the first one as well because it was like it was more of a cartoony style it was more of a cartoony style which I liked um, but this one you know they, they kind of took a more realistic approach which I liked the open world was fun um, I typically when it comes to open world games um, I'm very iffy on it there are times where I like it and then there are times where open world doesn't belong <laughs> in some games but me as I if it fits perfectly you know you're running around a city you're doing parkour and all that stuff I think that uh, that open world it, it, it benefited the game more than it took away and granted I did play more linear styled um, you know we did go from point A to point B most of the time and fast travel to where we needed to go um, but I did like the idea that we could take our own detours and go wherever we wanted and you know we could reach the mission uh, any which way that we wanted to so I liked that that's something that the first game lacked um, the writing uh, especially towards the end of there um, there are a lot of heart signs uh, in this credits of my um, what on earth um, the writing towards the end was a little cliche I uh, towards the end there like with um, faith in and Isabel it was a little it, it was a little uh you know, it was a little cliche, it was a little mediocre, um, but for the most part, I enjoyed the story, um, I enjoyed the, the missions, I thought it was fun, I thought it was a fun game, I enjoyed it, I enjoyed this game, I liked it, um, I can move around, but yeah, um, oh yeah, the music too, well, I don't know if I'm actually like skipping all this stuff, I was moving around my, my analog stick, um, Artist Churches had a once winning call. I know they wrote music for it, but the music was fantastic. I really enjoyed the music in this game. I really enjoyed the music in this game. I might have to actually just go back and listen to the soundtrack because it was great. It was some fantastic music. Um, it was really great. Um, but yeah, overall, I liked it. Um, I think I liked it better than the first game, even though I get frustrated with games like this, especially with some of the more timed stuff that they had here and. The combat was still, it's just not fluid. The combat's not fluid enough. It doesn't, I don't know, either way. Um, but yeah, overall, I think I liked this one better than the first one. I think I did. And I loved the first one. I really did. I, li I liked the first one. But, I don't know. This one was good. This one was good. Um, I'm going to go ahead and skip this. Joanna Kruger, CEO of Kruger Holding. Today announced the successor to Gabriel Kruger, having Kruger stuck and missing since the terrible events in Glass recently. Kruger will be superseded by his daughter, Isabel, who, while still mourning her Oh, I have to go. Your sister's the new head of Kruger sec. Mm. Interesting. Plastic made a breakthrough with Kuma. <laughs> <laughs> I'm off. I am sure glad to be rid of that crap. <laughs> That's one I owe you forever, Faith. So, what are you gonna do next? I'm gonna run. The shard completed. I was gonna say, I'm, I was waiting for us to actually complete this mission. Um, run kit drop defeat Kruger. One new upgrade point. Um, let's open this kit. Okay. Um, so, with that being said, we did get an upgrade point. We do have an upgrade point. Um, let's see. We actually do have an upgrade point. It, I don't know if it matters, but, um, disrupt. Okay. Um, I was going to say, I don't know. Oh, the lair looks... What happened to the lair? It doesn't look as beat up. It doesn't look destroyed. Did we like... Wait, what? Yeah. But, um, I was gonna say... 
Um, there are still some side missions we can do. Um, I don't know how many there are. There are actually quite. Ooh, there are a lot. There's one, two, three. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different side missions. It looks like. I think what we might do, um, even though this is like the finale of the actual, um, what should we call the actual story? I think I might go back. I might, I, I'm going to look into how many side missions there are. We're going to wrap this episode up here, by the way. I'm not going to start anything else here. We're going to go ahead and wrap it up. But, um, I think I might look into how many side missions are left for us. Um, I don't... I, I do kind of want to move on. I mean, I played through the game. Like I said, I just want to focus on the actual um, story of the game. Um, I don't know how many side missions are left. I mean, what we saw, there was only a handful. I don't know if those are going to lock anymore. Um, if that's all that we have left are those handful, um, I think what I'm going to do is just wrap them up and then call it good. Uh, we'll finish up the last few side missions. Maybe we'll have a couple more episodes. We'll have a couple more episodes for sure of the of the let's play. And then after that, we'll kind of move on to. Uh, can I not bash through this door? Move on to whatever we play through next. Um, but if they're just gonna keep unlocking side mission after side mission, uh, I I I don't want to play through too many. That's the whole thing. Like I don't want to play through too many. But we'll see. We'll see. Either way. Um, it is kind of cool that now we can just kind of free run and, uh, all that stuff. How do I get out of here? Where did I even come from? Where did I even come from? Um, can I fast travel out of here? And go back to the lair. Ooh. Is this new? Did I hit, I think I hit info. I've never seen that before. I think I accidentally hit info instead of fast travel. But... Um, I do have to say, I really did enjoy the game. Um, I think I liked it better than the first one. Just because it felt a lot more polished. And I will have to say, the first game was definitely... Uh, I mean, the game, the first one's like 10 years old. But it's it does not feel like that at all. Um, I played through, you know, we played through on the channel last year. And it still feels really, really good. So... Uh, it's no disrespect to the first game, but I just think that this one feels a lot more, ow, feels a lot better. Um, but, I think that's going to do it. I think that's going to wrap it up for Mirror Cyber I just want to run around a little bit, uh, explore. I really did like the, like I said, I really did like the, whoa, <laughs> we almost died to end things off with a death. Um, but I really did like the art style of this one uh, and, and everything, so. Uh, either way, I think that's going to be it. Um, let's go ahead and just go back to our house or our safe layer. Uh, I guess I keep hitting that now. Um, and yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the let's play. Um, we may continue with some side missions. Um, I'll have to look into it. If not, maybe we'll just jump into the next project on the channel. But um, I don't know. We'll see. Either way. With that being said, uh, I guess that's everything. I, I guess that is everything. Let me just make sure. That's, I don't think there's anything else. For us. I think that was it. So, yeah. With that said, you guys. Thank you so much for watching this Let's Play. I really do hope you guys enjoyed. I had an absolute blast with it. This was easily one of my favorite games uh, that we've played so far. Um, I really enjoyed it. Hopefully you guys did as well. And uh, as always, take care. Have yourselves a great day. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.